Hey everybody, it's Dr. Jason, and yes, my wife got fired yesterday. And I could not be more excited and proud of her because the person that fired my wife was my wife. Let me clarify, you know what, as parents, as business owners, heck, as human beings, so often we get sucked into these menial tasks, these to-do lists, these chores, these expectations where honestly we're barely kicking the can of existence down the road to a life of mediocrity. Man, I'm getting deep pretty fast here, but my point is life gets full of stuff that we weren't put on this planet to live for. And we realized that with my wife, that she was juggling 18,000 balls as a mom as a co-owner of this business, as a creative force behind so much that we do in life and at this practice, that she was getting drained. And honestly, so often in our lives, we get to the end of the day, no, forget that by lunchtime, we're like, if I don't have another gallon of coffee, I'm not gonna be able to finish this day without showing some hands at somebody. But my point is, what are you doing in life with this million dollar dream with a minimum wage mindset? So often, we are doing $10 hour tasks and expecting to be living a million dollar lifestyle. And I'm not talking about money. I'm talking about a million dollar marriage, a million dollar relationship with our kids, a million dollar body that's incredibly healthy. What are you doing in life that you need to quit? What do you need to fire yourself from? It's such an important thing to, to take into consideration on a regular basis because there are people in life out there that like to fold laundry, that would love to clean your house or cut your lawn. And the fact is, if you would take that energy and that focus and that passion away from that that's draining you and put it into something that's more dollar productive, you'll make more money. You'll have a better marriage. You'll have a better relationship with your kids. Yes, there is a price tag to have somebody clean our house and fold our laundry. But you know what? The cost of not doing it is so much more. So my wife got fired yesterday and we are celebrating, celebrating for the rest of our lives something to think about in your own life. What, would, what do you need to fire yourself from? We'll see you soon, guys.